Hello everyone. Welcome back into this tutorial on Informatica Data Director. In today's tutorial, we are going to see how to use cleans function, which are available in MDM Hub, and see how to achieve the various customization or cleansing in the IDD application. So, in order to do that, we have created few tables like party table or disable etc we'll see what are the cleans functions available so we have the various by default or uh, inbuilt cleans function for example string cleans function then we have the noise cleans function miscellaneous even if you create any custom cleans function and if you register in the MDM hub that will also available in the IDD but before making uh, making sure if it is available or not you have to go to the secure resources and check what is the whether the cleans function is secured or not so you can see these are the cleans function which are secure so let me make one of the cleans function unsecure and we will see that whether it's available there or not so I will take a right lock and I will make this compress white space uh, cleans function as a private <coughs> and we'll see whether this is available there or not if it is available if any other cleans function available we'll use that so I'm just saving this operation so whenever you make any secure resources that can be accessible in the IDD if it is private then it is accessible within the MDM hub and not outside the MDM hub so we just do the redeep brief uh, let me log into the IDD application this is IDD administration tool let me clear the cache and let's do redeploy so let's do one thing as a part of the testing or the demo we'll use one of the cleans function to demo so open your any application whatever you have created so so far we have created customer as a subject area go to the cleans section and here you can see various cleans functions like data conversion string function geographic math function miscellaneous etc let's select string function from the cleans you can select any of this cleans function right now uh, looks like the cache is not clear that is the reason it is showing the compressed white space otherwise you will not able to see here we will use the uppercase cleans function what are the fields where you want to use the uppercase function for example if you want to use for the full name select the full name and click ok suppose if you want to any other cleans function let's go ahead go to the cleanse function and let's see suppose you want some data conversion and suppose you want to convert from parts that if you are getting input data as a string and you want to convert it parts that you can use it so for the testing let's just use the uppercase cleans function which is present inside the string operation uppercase and click ok so I'm making full name as a uppercase save it generate business entity schema and validate it I would recommend one thing whenever you make any uh, secure role specific uh, changes go to the repository manager and validate the schema so by that way it will reflect the latest changes right now it is not reflect in the IDD it could be the because we are not validated the schema but we will use the one of the cleans function that is the our intention so I'm not worried about the making secure or private so I validated generated generated the entity schema and also validated the ORS 
now we are good to use our application go to this tool click on login and let's try to create one of the customer so i will use small case and let's see it convert into upper case so my full name is mike paul first name is mike last name is paul give any value for the ssn let's try with address let's add one address here I'm putting the state country and some ID apply it and just click save button so if you notice so what are the record which got created now it is just trying to match it but the, it is get converted into the upper case even if I'm sending small case so if you want to proceed you can proceed it or if you want to cancel you can see even it is cancelled state it is automatically converted so whenever you apply at the time itself it convert into that uppercase cleanse function so apply button or apply action take care of the applying the cleanse function you can use any cleanse function for each of the fields where you want you can just click save and i will proceed it and by proceeding means it will create a new record if you want to merge you can just merge it or you can select the other record if you want so this will create one record for us so now the record got created so this is very simple tutorial how to use cleans function in the IDD so I know this is very basic tutorial but it help you to understand how the flow works thank you again for watching my video if you have any questions or queries you can mention in the comment section of this video thank you and have a nice time